hello friends and fans and subscribers so this is kind of a conventional video the first part i wired this in um did a big not a big did a video on it and then i was doing the thumbnail i was like oh my gosh uh there's a way way simpler way to do this and i'm obviously not familiar with these we service them we just don't install them uh, so I'm going to show you the easy way to do it right now and then it will segue into the more complicated way so however you want to do it this is how you wire in a orbit controller and a rain, rain sensor any rain sensor not um, it could be orbits rain sensor or hunter or toro or weathermatic or whoever so uh, here we go all right, so we just open this up now. You can see this is how I wired it in, but I am gonna just show you how to wire this in. Um, I'm gonna not give you all the details right here because I already gave the details. Anyways, this is coming from the valve box, and this is the common. So this one needs to go into here. So I'm gonna wire that in when I get two hands. And then these two wires, um, they are coming from the rain sensor. And for whatever reason, someone put irrigation wires in here versus the wires that originally came with the sensor. So what you're gonna do is make sure the Make sure those are in there in a second. Uh, so you got your two wires coming from the rain sensor going to the sensor and then just like normal um, the common from the valve box goes into the common. But I didn't even notice this there's a sensor on off thing. So I'm gonna wire it in and then I'm gonna hit this on and then it'll start working. The sensor will start working but the way I did have it and in the pre, oh, I guess post seating following video, you'll be able to tell how I wired it and made it work. All right, so I uh, always had two hands, push this up, put those wires in, and now I'm just going to make sure the sensor is on. And now it's working. Well, I'm going to double check it, but I know it's going to work. As far as I know, the orbits don't show you when the sensor's working. A lot of them will have a little, uh, it's like a little umbrella icon showing that the sensor has turned that irrigation system off. So with these guys, I don't see it. So I'm just gonna just manu manually run it. But it will, um, n those zones will not turn on. So that's the only way I know to check these things. And zone one is not on because the sensor's working. Alrighty. All right, I'll keep this quick. I want to show you how to wire it in a rain sensor. This one's a specifically Hunter Mini Click, an old one, into an orbit controller. So I found this one not wired in right. And I don't think it's ever probably ever worked right. So I'm going to show you what I found, and then I will show you how to wire it in. Alrighty, enjoy. Right. Orbit controller. Um, right now I've got zone three running, and then this is how it's wired in. These wires are going to the rain sensor, um, and then this one's obviously going to the valve box. And then I'm gonna show you how it's wired in up top at the rain sensor because the roofers broke it and I just redid it. All right, so this actually was all pointing down and the roofers kind of damaged this thing, but I got, got it working for the most part. And these wires were cut, so I just put some grease caps on there, try to tuck it up under here, I guess. It's kind of short. And then you can see blue and white. It doesn't matter, just as long as you remember what wires there. But these, this is specifically blue and white. All right, so I'm gonna try 
Try to do this with one hand, see how it goes. Ooh. Pull those out. Or it's really fast and easy with a helper or a camera person. As you can see, so zone three, that was on. It's off because I just broke the circuit. But I'm gonna rewire this in. And I'll wire it in better once I get two hands free, but for now I just want to show you what's happening here. Alright, so we got so with this, I just wired it, that extra wire coming from the rain sensor, I just wired it straight into the sensor terminal on the orbit controller. Normally we put that into the common terminal, but it worked and I just kept it right where it was at. All right, good luck. The common from the bow box and then one, one of those wires from the rain sensor. To test it, all you do is hold this little guy down and it turns off. I don't know if you can hear it. So it turned off. All right, here we go, different angle. So I'm gonna push it down and it went off. And let go and it comes back on. So this one's working. Let's see, you see that one over there? Oh, there you go. That sprinkler head over there. Boom, job done.